Hey guys, what's up? It's Mexican Pizza, and today, I know it looks like I'm at an Asian spot. And guess what, I am. I'm at a local restaurant that's a Chinese restaurant, and I'm gonna be uh, reviewing their food today. It's like a Shanghai type food. So let's get right to it. Oh, that's pretty neat. Milk tea. Tastes nice and sweet, like milk. Um, like after the milk you drink after you've eaten your Fruity Pebbles, that's what it tastes like. It tastes pretty yummy. It just came out and it smells really good. It's, it's steaming, it looks really nice, and um, it, I'm really hungry now. I just wanna dig in. So I got my rice my plate and I really want to dig into these dumplings. These are some pork dumplings. They look really good. Give that a try. Mmm. That tastes really good. Mmm. It's nice. It's got a crunchy layer at the bottom when they pan fried it so it's like really soft and you bite into the pork. And then you got that crispy layer at the bottom. It's really good. Now, I don't know how to play mahjong, but I should learn. I heard it's fun. It's not like dominoes, is it? Nah. So I'm gonna go ahead and try the fish. This looks awesome. This is a fried fish dish. I forgot what it's called. Um, I'll put the name down below. Uh, but it's definitely lightly fried. It's a bass, I know that. It's got some onions and some veggies and a nice little sauce around it. It's, it's a sweet sauce, so it's got a sweeter. You know, I read somewhere that um, I, uh, the Shanghai people have um, like a sweet tooth, so maybe this sauce kind of explains that rock on because that's what you do when you go to the bathroom, you rock on. Restroom. <laughs> Time to try this delicious looking pork plate. Looks like pork and it's got a really nice brown sauce with some onions and jalapenos. Looks really good. Oh wow, I thought it was pork, it's chicken, and that's really freaking good. It's so soft. <laughs> Whoops. Dang, that looks, that's really good, I can't drop it. I gotta keep that, sorry, there's a five second rule and I think I picked it up before that. I can't let this chicken go, it looks so good. That's some really soft and moist chicken. Like, it's got a lot of flavor. Not sweet, not spicy at all. I really like that. This is probably gonna be my best, my favorite dish so far out of the ones I've tried. It's, it's a perfect blend uh, with the brown sauce and the chicken, it falls right off the bone. And the potato just melts in your mouth like cotton candy. <laughs> That's how, that's how perfectly cooked it is. So that's awesome. So time to try this final dish I ordered. These look like huge meatballs. And um, it's got mushroom. I'm not a big fan of mushroom. <laughs> but, um, and it, oh, and it's got glass noodles. These are like the clear noodles. That looks pretty good. And it's got some greens in there. The baby bok choy. Um, I used to work at an Asian restaurant, so I know what that is when I see it. And I think those are bamboo shoots, but we'll find out here in a bit. Oh, I forgot to get some meatball. How could I forget? I'm not that great with chopsticks. Mm. Wow, this is like a uh, this is a soupy, like a soup-like dish. 
because of the noodles. I don't know what this is. Definitely not bamboo shoots. It has, um, maybe just bamboo shoots. Um, I can't really describe the flavor. It's kind of like a broth, like a beef broth flavored type. And uh, the meatball is like, it just melts in your mouth, just like the chicken did. It's really soft and um, at least the, the core part of it is really soft. Actually the entire thing is pretty soft. And then the noodles are kind of uh, jumbo. Not thin noodles, they're kind of like fat noodles. It's a good combination, I would say. I'm not trying the mushrooms though. All right guys, so I'm gonna let you in on a little secret. You wanna know how to tell an authentic restaurant from a non-authentic restaurant? All right, take a look at their slogan. Once go bun walk, never go work. It doesn't make sense to me. And I think that's how you can tell they're authentic. But anyway, um, they have some really cool things I like about the restaurant though. They um, have some really interesting decor like these pillows, they have minion pillows and um, the Mario pillow, the mushrooms. Um, I thought that was really cool. They got Batman and then their lighting is, it's got some cute um, clouds that look like they're from the Mario video game as well. Um, so I thought that was really nice. And um, they're actually, I noticed that they're clean. <laughs> I don't know if you guys have ever been to an Asian restaurant, but you know, those, some, some of those Asian restaurants are not that clean and it's nice to know that they're making an effort to, to keep the place clean. So guys, there you have it, Bund Walk. I was here and I thought their food was definitely very good quality food for a great price. It, if you're ever in the North Dallas area, come check them out. They're, like I said, really good. I don't know why I just said that again, like I said. So guys, if I have any Asian fans out there that are watching this video, uh, comment down on the video below, let me know. Uh, what types of foods I should be trying in the uh, Asian uh, restaurants. <laughs> and um, yeah, uh, don't forget to subscribe, guys. See you later. Bye.